William Edward Hartpole Lecky, the 26th of March 1838 to the 22nd of October 1903, was an Irish historian, essayist, and political theorist with Whig proclivities. His major work was an eight-volume history of England during the 18th century. Topic: <laughs> Early life. Born at Newtown Park, near Dublin, he was the eldest son of John Hartpole Leckie, a landowner. He was educated at Kingstown, Armagh, at Cheltenham College, and at Trinity College, Dublin, where he graduated BA in 1859 and MA in 1863, and where he studied divinity with a view to becoming a priest in the Church of Ireland. Career <laughs> 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 In 1860, Lecky published anonymously a small book entitled The Religious Tendencies of the Age, but on leaving college he turned to historiography. In 1861 he published Leaders of Public Opinion in Ireland, containing brief sketches of Jonathan Swift, Henry Flood, Henry Grattan and Daniel O'Connell, originally anonymous, republished in 1871. The essay on Swift, rewritten and amplified, appeared again in 1897 as an introduction to an edition of Swift's works. Two surveys followed, A History of the Rise and Influence of Rationalism in Europe two vols, 1865, and A History of European Morals from Augustus to Charlemagne two vols, 1869. The latter aroused criticism, with its opening dissertation on the natural history of morals. Lecky then concentrated on his major work, A History of England during the 18th Century, Vols, I, and E, of which appeared in 1878, Vols, V, and V in 1887, and Vols, V, and V, which completed the work, in 1890. In the Cabinet edition of 1892, in twelve volumes later reprinted, A History of Ireland in the 18th Century is separated out. A volume of poems 1891 was less successful. In 1896, he published two volumes entitled Democracy and Liberty, in which he considered modern democracy. The pessimistic conclusions at which he arrived provoked criticism both in the UK and USA, which was renewed when he published in a new edition 1899 his low estimate of William Ewart Gladstone, then recently dead. In The Map of Life 1899, Lecky discussed in a popular style ethical problems of everyday life. In 1903 he published a revised and enlarged edition of Leaders of Public Opinion in Ireland, in two volumes, with the essay on Swift omitted and that on O'Connell was expanded into a complete biography. A critic of the methods by which the Act of Union was passed, Lecky, who grew up as a moderate liberal, was opposed to Gladstone's policy of home rule and, in 1895, he was returned to Parliament as Unionist member for Dublin University in a by-election. In 1897, he was made a privy councillor. In the 1902 Coronation Honours List published on 26 June 1902, he was nominated an original member of the New Order of Merit Ohm. <laughs> Degrees His university honours included the degree of LL.D. from Dublin, St Andrews and Glasgow, the degree of DCL from Oxford and the degree of Lit.D. from Cambridge. In 1894 he was elected corresponding member of the Institute of France. He contributed occasionally to periodical literature, and two of his addresses, The Political Value of History 1892 and The Empire, Its Value and Its Growth 1893, were published. <laughs> <laughs> Family and posthumous recognition After his father died when Lecky was 14, he was raised as a member of the family of the 8th Earl of Carnwith, his stepmother's husband. He was married in 1871 to Elizabeth Van Dedham, a lady in waiting to Queen Sophie of the Netherlands and member of the aristocratic Van Dedham family. The couple had no children. Elizabeth, herself a writer and historian, contributed articles, chiefly on historical and political subjects, to various reviews. In 1904, money for a memorial was raised by subscription and a statue by Goscombe John was erected in Trinity College, Dublin. A volume of Lecky's historical and political essays was published posthumously, London, 1908, edited and introduced by his wife. The Lecky Chair of History at Trinity College, Dublin, was endowed by his widow in 1913. 
In 1978, part of the college's humanities library complex was named in his honor. <laughs> Learned societies and other activities Lecky was elected a member of the American Antiquarian Society in 1891. Bibliography History of the Rise and Influence of the Spirit of Rationalism in Europe. 1865, online History of European Morals from Augustus to Charlemagne 1869, Volume 1 of 2, Volume 2 of 2 A History of England in the 18th Century 1878, online edition Volume 1, Volume 8 A History of England in the 18th Century 1888-1890 Eight rare original volume set in private collection from the estate of Eleanor Silliman Belknap Humphrey New York, D. Appleton and Company, 1, 3, and 5 Bond Street, includes all chapters, preface, bibliography, and index. Democracy and Liberty, 1896. Map of Life, 1899, online. Introduction to Edward Gibbons. The History of the Decline and Fall of the Roman Empire, 1906, online. Historical and Political Essays. 1908, online, Gutenberg Online Advertisement in New York Times seeking subscriptions to Lecky's Memorial Fund the 9th of July 1904, facsimile Notes <laughs>